always. I will say it again and rejoice. Philippians 4.4. 4. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm afraid I will trust in you. Psalms 56, verse 3. Do unto others as you would want them to do unto you. Luke 6.31.
and courageous. Do not be terrified. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Proverbs 9-1. Joshua 9-1. <laughs> <laughs>
We gave points for t-shirts, for um, worksheets, for bringing your Bible, um, bringing friends, memory verses, um, looking up books of the Bible, um, and just um, the way you behaved in class and stuff. It was really hard, but um, we felt like the person that deserved the bronze the most is the person that we feel improved the most, and um, I had the privilege of leading him into salvation this year in our class, and that's Dallas, Dallas Perret. Um, and the second person, um, she just really worked hard all year long. She did her work, she brought her papers, she, she wore a t-shirt, and she really tried hard, and she's not here tonight either. And that was Gwyneth Hazel. And um, the, uh, the person who gets the gold is um, drove me crazy all year long. <laughs> because we couldn't leave our house without her t-shirt. If she didn't have it on, we had to go back. <laughs> if she didn't um, have her paper, she would go crazy. And she wanted to make her own in the room because <laughs> she, she just wanted to get everything done all year long. And, um, and that would be Elena. <laughs> but in all honesty, they all deserve it. So they just did a wonderful job. I love them all. Sherry's really quiet. At first, I didn't know she spoke. 
<laughs> she's been really a joy. She, um, very great. She, she really knows what she's doing. She's done a great job this year. Then we have Rebecca George. And you think Sherry's quiet, you should meet Rebecca. <laughs> they, they, the sisters have been wonderful in the class. They've helped out a lot. Um, they bring a lot of joy to us in the class, too. Then we have Tyler Files. And I would have to say Tyler's one of our boy class clowns. Tyler's been with us two years, and we've really enjoyed him being in class. He's done a really great job learning his Bible verses. Then we have uh, Morgan Phillips, could not be with us tonight. And R.H. Jenkins, we also miss tonight. Okay, um, in my class, we also did, like, in Susan's class, the children memorize Bible verses. We have work, we have workbook pages we have to do. They have to take them home and bring them back. Um, some of the kids have learned books of the Bible next year. Um, we also games, uh, Bible, they bring their Bible in, they get points. And one other important thing was in our classes, we started keeping track of how is our behavior, what are we doing, you know? Um, are we being respectful to each other, to the teachers, to the world around us? So um, it was kind of hard to the points, like Susan said. Some of our kids really did high on doing the Bible verses, memorizing things, bringing the Bibles in, but we had to look at the attitude part too, and so we did a lot of that this year. And we also did it percentage-wise, so Poor TJ wouldn't be left out because he came in the middle of the year. We wanted to make sure that it was fair to all the children. So our, for our bronze this year, DJ Coy. <laughs> and our silver is Natalie. <laughs> and our gold goes to Sherry. They, they, all the children have done wonderful jobs. That's why we felt it was important. They all got medals tonight because they're all wonderful. Um, I believe most, all of my class have come to know their, the Lord is their Savior. And that's really a great joy in my heart. And they're, um, they've been most, all of them have been saved before they joined our class this year. So it's been wonderful that you've all known the Lord. They've been a joy to us. Um, they're great. We can't wait till next year. I like all my sixth graders to come right here. We have to say goodbye to Sherry and Natalie and DJ and Sarah. In September, they'll be joining our team group. If the team leader's here, good luck. <laughs> um, they, they've all been just wonderful. It's a joy and an honor that you let us have your children with us every Wednesday night. Uh, we hope that you'll bring them back to us next Wednesday night in September. We'll be starting again. If you have friends and neighbors that have children, we welcome them. They do not have to be a member of our church to come to Team, uh, team Kids. We would just love to have all of them here with us. And we just want to say thank you all. And now we're going to have um, our youth pastor, Jeff, come up and share a few words with us.